President Uhuru Kenyatta on Wednesday kicked off the latest phase of a national title deeds issuance program that will see the immediate issuance of one million title deeds uh, to landowners across the country. Issuing 200 title deeds to signify the start of a program at the International Convention Center, um, that is Kenyatta International Convention Center in Nairobi. President Kenyatta decried, or that directed the cabinet secretaries for lands and interior to come up with a program that will involve other cabinet secretaries in the instance of a balance of already titled deeds to expeditiously execute the exercise. President Uhuru Kenyatta has highlighted several achievements under the reforms in the land sector, noting that the national titling program which his administration introduced in 2013 has helped in processing and issuing title deeds to many citizens. This has been through the collaboration with government in surveying, verification of ownership documents, and supporting alternative dispute resolution processes. Now, you and your GIA could gender inch. Because the Babu Sasa will miss idea Mutu, who are Nakitu and Bachu and Areza Kukopa, Nakuinu Aliake, Kujenga Biasharayake, Kukuza Shambayake. The head of state noted that the national title deeds issuance program has made it possible for Kenyans living in the marginalized areas such as Samburu, Isiolo, and Marsabit counties to legally own land, thereby empowering them to develop economically. Kutoka upande ya Samburu, kutoka upande ya 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 ambao wanaambiwa hii area hii yote ni yenu lakini hawana document yoyote ya kuwaonesha kesho unasikia mtu amechukua kitu mtu amechukua fulani mtu amechukua inaleta vita inaleta shida sasa kila mtu atakuwa na cheti chake kusema hapa ni kwangu na uwezi uguze kwangu President Kenyatta also pointed out that under the national tightening program all beneficiaries living in the former colonial villages, such as those in Nandaro, were issued with the title deeds. While the problem of long and protracted land cases in group ranges across the country were addressed. Atambele ya mzungu, lakini kila saa wanaambiwa rudini kwenu. Kwenu ni wapi? Kwenu ni hapo, unaishi na ukona... Na, na ukona cheti yako ya kusema hii ni shamba yangu. Ya? Yeah? Hakuna mtu anaweza kukufukuza unarudi wapi hapo ambapo upo ndipo kwako na mimi na waomba let us treat this as a valuable document let us not treat these documents as individually owned this document belongs to you and your family and you must sit and plan together Marasabit we have 3000 this is the first time we are registering Marasabit the president added that through the program the government has been able to secure the country's natural resources and heritage sites, which were under the threat of being grabbed. The government is also documenting land belonging to public institutions, while the Minister of Lands and Physical Planning, working with partners in the education sector, has succeeded in titling parcels of land belonging to 20,000 schools and the surveying of 32,000 public schools. Your Excellency, this is a very significant number because you will be happy to note, Your Excellency, that the colonial government and our first three administration registered six million. So actually, you've surpassed slightly the million registered in the past 100 years. We thank you, Your Excellency.